What the hell is this? My God, my old music box. <laughs> I haven't seen that in years. Daddy gave me that. I think I was five. Maybe five and a half. <laughs> I remember my father's smile in the glow of my bedside light. Hmm. He, he took the blankets beneath my chin to settle me for the night. And the stories he tell to me, they had a, a magic now, so it seems. They all began once upon a time in a land of fairy tale dreams. Hmm. There'd be a princess that no man could resist. She'd make a frog into a prince with, with just a kiss. Or a shiny knight with a magic sword. <laughs> Daddy'd act it out just word for word. And when it came to the part where the hero died, he'd hug me closely while I cried. And he'd whisper in my ear, Don't worry, dear, because heroes never die. He'd run his fingers through my hair and he'd say, Heroes never die. But the greatest hero of my life, you know, he, he never slayed a monster or left some troll dead. He was just a plain and simple man that each night took me in my bed. And I think of Daddy and his love and his touch and how we all laughed so much. And I don't miss him, you know, not a single bit. <laughs> so why would I? Heroes never die. He'd smile and he'd say, Heroes never die, my child. Well, that's that. <laughs>